Let's take a couple minutes to talk about how to be successful in the cold stock class. I'm going to explain to you exactly how to take this class and how to be successful week over week. It's pretty simple, actually. When you're ready to work on one of my classes, you're going to find that class in Schoology. It's going to take you to the updates page. You want to make sure you read those updates. Every week there will be an update that tells you that the weekly lesson is available. And after you do everything that you're supposed to to complete that weekly lesson, you're going to take a look at the week at a glance presentation. So there's a presentation for every week that tells you exactly what you're doing and why. And you also want to review the calendar so that you're pacing your work correctly. Then and only then you are going to complete each week of the course one week at a time from top to bottom. So let me show you what that looks like. So here I am in Schoology. I'm taking a Colstock class. The first thing I need to do is I need to find that class. It doesn't matter which one I choose. All my classes are structured the same. So here's my intro to programming class. I land on the updates page. I read all the updates every time. I comment. I like everything Colstock says. Every week there is a new lesson. It is on the calendar. You'll see it on the right. For example, for programming, it says intro to programming, and then it'll say the quarter and the week. To access the lesson, I can click here, or I can click on the link that's been provided as part of the update. No two lessons for any week are the same, but they pretty much look like this. There's going to be things for you to read, and you need to complete everything that is listed in order. I'll normally have an instructional video or a weekly update video. I will also have an idea of what you should do when you come to the lab. So this is a huge part of being successful in my courses is to read the updates and to do the weekly lesson. Now, when you're done with the weekly lesson, you need to go to whatever week you're working on. For week one, you would go to week one and you always start with the week at a glance. The week at a glance is a presentation that I have that I, for every single week that explains to you what we're doing and why. So these are the uh, no understand and demonstrate our CUD. You want to read that and then I have a breakdown for you of exactly the tasks that you are going to accomplish. Normally this is Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and then here I try to give you an idea of what we're doing in class together. Once you have read and understood the week at a glance then you might want to go back to updates and click on this little calendar icon. The calendar icon will break down for you exactly what we do on each day. This long calendar link, this is the weekly lesson. So you always want to click on that first if you want to access things through the calendar. And then I will have paced the workout for you and told you roughly what you should be working on each day for a nice even workload. Once you've done all those things, and only once you've done all those things, go back to materials, go to the quarter that you're in, go to the week that you're working on, and then you will complete the assignments and the instructions for the week in order from top to bottom. The way most things are structured is resource assignment, resource assignment, resource assignment, resource assignment. And then in certain cases, things like quizzes are both a resource and an assignment. There are going to be many assignments that are ungraded, but you should do them anyway. I highly recommend using this sidebar, which breaks down the calendar for you in order. So if you have any questions with that, please uh, see me. Remember, find the course in Schoology. Read the updates every day. Complete the weekly lesson. You can click on the link that's the update, or you can click on the sidebar, which has the weekly lesson. Make sure you read the week at a glance for every single week. It has your CUD as well as what you will be accomplishing that week. And make sure you're looking at the calendar so that you can graphically see what you're doing in the class. Then and only then you will complete the assignments in order by week from top to bottom. And most things are listed resource assignment, resource assignment. I hope that helps. Next thing you need to do is you need to go to updates and take a look for the lesson for the first week that is posted.